So, um, it's Monday on the way. Not like it matters. I just kind of randomly upload videos. Um, <clears throat> but as of, oh, sorry. Oh, I was eating peanut butter earlier, so I don't, I completely spaced. Yeah, like, I have videos that I recorded, but I might have to redo them just because I don't know how to upload videos apparently. Um, and I'm apparently recording on too high of a resolution for my computer. So even like a four minute video that I recorded in like super awesome HD is only like half of it uploads to YouTube. So I'm like, well, fuck it, who cares? I lower the resolution on my camera and hopefully that'll work. Um, I'll obviously figure out by if this video gets uploaded or not. Um, I might edit it a little bit just because the opening was kind of awkward. And then, yeah. <clears throat> I also have a video of me and some co-workers doing the cinnamon challenge. It's kind of funny. I got a big cloud of cinnamon in my face and I thought there was cinnamon in the air for like the longest and then I realized <laughs> the cinnamon was just stuck to my glasses, so embarrassing. Um, but no, I want to talk about this video, uh, or in this video, about stupid stuff that happens when you're drunk. For instance, you go over to a friend's house, you're, you know, having a good time, whatever, talking, etc, etc, you're eating, um, you start drinking wine, lots of it, yeah. <laughs> and champagne and whatnot, and then, you know, you're watching Margaret Cho, who's really funny, by the way, I love Margaret Cho, hi, hilarious, and you start playing music, random things happen, you get really drunk, you don't know what's going on, you play with the dog, and, like, it jumps on you, and you're like, ah, what do I do, what do I do, uh. And then you, for whatever reason, start to wrestle your friend, who's like probably three times your size. But you take him to the ground, which is pretty awesome. It's okay, you know. Death grip between my legs. It's kind of like being in a headlock, but between my legs. Yeah, it kind of sounds kind of awkward, but you don't want to be there because I was just like crushing my friend. I was just crushing him. And <laughs> the only way for him to like get me to stop was to try and choke me. And that didn't work very much, so I started laughing too hard and I couldn't hold it anymore. So I just kind of fell over. Other random shit happens, like, you get snapped with a towel, you know, you take it, and you fucking, oh, I have a shirt, whatever. And you like, and like fucking flick it, or whatever, at somebody's, like, ass. That doesn't hurt very much when it's just a towel. And then I realized, holy shit, he got it wet. He wet the tip of it and smacked me. Now, he hit me on my ass a couple times, and that doesn't hurt. Like, my ass can take some damage. Uh, he started, like, getting my legs, and I got kind of pissed. <laughs> I was just like, the fuck is wrong with you? Like, it hurts really bad. My legs are apparently really sensitive. Wait, I think that happened, and then I tackled him to the ground because I was trying to get the towel from him and whip him back, and that wasn't working so well. Normally I'm pretty good at, like, whipping, but <laughs> everything in this video is just so sexual. <laughs> okay. <laughs> we were fighting over the towel, and that's why we ended up wrestling. I took him to the ground, and, like, I think I started punching on his chest. I don't know, I wasn't paying it too drunk. So then you proceed to the kitchen, where you... I don't know what you do in the kitchen. And then you make out in the kitchen. And then they lift you onto the counter. But it's not really the counter, it's the oven. But you don't care because you think you're just making out. And then next thing you know, they're turning the oven on. Not, not the oven, the stove, excuse me. The oven, well, they're still on the oven, but the stove, whatever, you know what I'm talking about. And they sit you on top of the oven. So you're sitting on the stove. Is that what it's called? Stove oven? Yeah. So they turn the stove on and it starts to heat up under your ass. Who turns the stove on while you have somebody sitting on it? Who? At first it took me a minute because I was drunk so I was just like, eh, he's probably just pretending and gonna turn it back off. And then I jumped up and I was like, what are you doing? What are you doing? And then he put me back down on the stove and I felt it get warm so I like jumped and like clung to him. And I was like, 
oh my god, you almost set me on fire. Like, everything I wear is flammable. Like, my jeans are flammable, my underwear is flammable, hair is flammable, shirts are usually flammable, and the lotions that I wear are probably flammable. Like, that was ridiculous. Like, I think that is the most ridiculous thing that has ever happened to me while making out with somebody. Yeah, that's kind of some of my life right there. But yeah, I just thought I'd like to share that little bit of life with you um, in the moment. Hopefully, if I get this video uploaded, um, I'll upload the cinnamon challenge one. And then um, I'll obviously do more videos more often because um, I have nothing better to do. And because I actually know how to work my camera and upload it and whatnot again, or for once, the first time whatever yeah so i hope you guys had a lovely lovely monday as most people do but um my monday wasn't my monday was pretty bad yeah i'm not gonna lie um but yeah so um hope you have a good rest of the week and i will see you hopefully i'll shoot for tomorrow <laughs> I was going to say Wednesday, and then I thought about it, and I was like, well, maybe, depending on the video, I guess, tomorrow or Wednesday, how this goes.